So this is your cables. These are burnt, so they ain't been making a very good connection. So watch out for that. If that's happening, you want to tighten these leads or clean them up a bit. But there should be about 0.4 ohms between them. It's saying 0.9. That was 0.7. Probably because these are all filthy in here. So 0.7 and 0.7. So see as they're all close, you just go test between each other. Test between that one and that one, that one and that one, and then that one and that one. And make sure they're all equal. But they should really be below 0.4 ohms, but it's a bit cold today, so probably affecting the readings. This is your pickup coil or your crankshaft position sensor you don't really want to be damaging these pins either so no reading So I'm getting 259 ohms, so that's a, I don't know the exact reading for these, but I will put it, a picture up at the end of this video so you can check it. But 259 is pretty good to me. So that's the pickup coil and the stator tested, both alright. So let's whip it off. It's only a few nuts, there's one missing there, but... Looks like that's the starter motor bolt. Sometimes you have to take this off when you uh, do the top end because the chain comes off the bottom. Make sure you undo all the nuts. That's it, that's your stator, your pickup coil, there's your flywheel, there's your flywheel bolts, your chains at the back, you can just see it, there's your starter gear, so that's coming off next but we'll go get a tool for it yet. Yeah.